awake? Oh my gosh. Wait though, just imagine with the Anbu traveling. Um, like wouldn't that like cause massive amount of earthquakes like all the time? Citations viewers, my name is Game Dame, and welcome to the Wandering Village demo. Now, this is a game I'm very much looking forward to, and I definitely wanted to read this uh, cute little intro here. We are Strayfawn Studio, and any team from Switzerland, thank you very much for checking out our game. The Wandering Village is still in development, and many things are unfinished. If you find any bugs or have any feedback which should be improved, please let us know with this button. If you have any questions, it's best to hop on our Discord and leave us a wish list to enjoy the game. I definitely got it. Now, this looks really, really cute, and I'm very excited to play this uh, demo for you guys today. Uh, let's do, call it the just a demo save. Um, Driven from our homes by the toxic spores, Ooh. we kept wandering, looking for shelter. But not in our wildest dreams did we imagine what we would find. It's a giant boy. Oh, fuck. Uh, the poor thing seems exhausted to go back to sleep now. Once read that Anbu draw their nutrients from the ground. So I wonder if we can sustain itself out here. Seems like we need to take care of each other from now on. My experience has brought our people here, but now it is time for you to take over and lead them to a better place. The easy transition. I could teach you a little bit. I've learned. Yes. Um, so I definitely want to... Oh. Okay. Shelter! Open the Elder's Notebook with the... Notebook. That's the glossary. Move the camera, pause the game. Enter the Anbu view. Whoa. Enter the world view. Whoa, that's really cool. This is really cool. I like the look and stylization that they have in this game. Housing, build tents for all your villagers. Destruction tool, harvest tool, priority tool, research tree. Uh, I think I don't have any research buildings. <laughs> oh man, wait, how do I do this? I com I feel like I completely missed it. Um, building menu, here we go. So we can get some tents in. Uh, we definitely need a research building. Okay. And used to manage workers, make them specialize as transformers, harvesters, or builders. Worker in this building gets small movement speed boost. We're going to have like a bunch of tents. What does this mean? Housing for up to two villagers improves productivity and inhabitants is offers slight protection from poisonous air. So it looks like we need additional wood. This is so cute. And now we have a uh, research we could do. You have two scientists. Nice. So we need them all to harvest some wood. We need a lot more wood. This is a game I can fuck with hard. This 
This is a game I can definitely fuck with. Uh, we need lots of more wood. It's so... Not only is it soothing, but the art is beautiful. <gasps> the time of day changed. We still need another tent! And it moves it. That is so cool. Wow. And setting the priority for these two. Two, four, I think I need more. More housing. Who are you? Oh, is that the village elder? Well, it's like 3 a.m. We should probably all go to sleep. Do these people ever sleep? Oh god, it's already 4 a.m. These people must be tired. I don't even know what he wants. Workplace, research building. Maybe a worker, but material storage I think would be good. Your people need food. A quick way to get is harvest berry bushes. Good thing uh, there is lots of berry bushes around. Oh, and the little balloons. That means they're going to be taken care of. Need more wood. Looks like wood will always be needed, to be quite honest. So I got a stockpile of 60 berries. You can construct a pantry to store food. Uh, that would actually be really good. We just need lots of wood and stone, and we have plenty of stone. We need a shit ton of wood. Alright, that's enough stone. Let's, uh, just get all of this wood out of the way. What's with all these berries? Just piles of berries everywhere. So they don't pick up the resources. Unless this person's picking them up. Oh no, he's getting that tree. All right, yeah, now it just needs wood. Which the workers are working towards. Oh, we are getting a nice stockpile though. Of the berries. Oh, that's really cool. It's awake? Oh my gosh. Wait though, just imagine with the Anbu traveling. Um... Like, wouldn't that, like, cause massive amount of earthquakes, like, all the time? Uh, you- y'all still need some work to do. So, we need- we need wood. Some berries, definitely. We still need to stockpile on all these berries here. Can I do like... Alright, so I can't do like a group thing. Um, 
A water tank would be very good as well. Here, I'll put that like, I don't know, like right next to the houses. These people never sleep. Have at least one farm assigned plots to your farm. Set the amount of workers to your farm to three. Have at least one herbalist. Well, I don't have a farm. Not yet, that is. Automatically extracts water from the air. Works better at higher humidity levels. No water is produced in deserts. Um, this is probably very important to have. And then we need a farm. I don't want it to be too far away. But let's put it right here. Choose your next research. Let's do a kitchen. So we can do all what we need to do. I just feel bad for these people because they're just doing shit nonstop. At their own speed. That's not a bad thing. This makes management a little bit easier. It's not like super fast. Um, and we need to clear out these rocks too. I wish I could multiply select them or do like a whole bunch of them at once. Like I would like in StarCraft or something where I'm able to just... Um, Group select. I think a group select would be really cool. Maybe I missed it. I think I might have missed it. It's so soothing though. It's incredibly soothing. Villagers move slightly faster on dirt roads. Oh, that's cool. So someone's got to build it for sure. These, these dirt roads. Very interesting. I love how they're <laughs> hammering down on the dirt roads. We don't have a worker post. Maybe that's something good to have. And I keep grouping everything. Worker post will go right here. Oh, this one's going to be finished. The farm, finally. I wonder if this is red because I can't do it here. Um... Oh, must plots must be placed on grass soil. So I literally, I fucked up. I messed up. God damn it. I feel bad. This is, this should be probably right around here, the farm. But I think we have those resources at least. So here's the farm. Do we have those resources? It looks like we do. Which I think is really nice. Um, OK. 
construction. Ooh. We can focus on construction. So we're passing... What is this? Nobads. Oh! Uh, this is so wild. And you could look at exactly what's happening here. Oh, the roads are built. Hell yeah. Yeah, see, now they're bringing all the resources over here. Which I think is really nice. My call plants and harvest mushrooms as ingredients for herbalists. So yeah, this this has to be on grasslands. I'm gonna put the herbalist over here and then maybe a mycologist. So this one gets placed on dirt mounds. Which I don't think is too bad. I know, I know I'm not following the what it's asking me, but I'm already in love with this game. Like, this game is incredibly soothing. Uh, we definitely need to collect more resources for fucking sure. So let's make sure we're able to get this. We have plenty of berries that we can gather. I know our people are hungry. I wonder if and what like we need exactly. Okay, so we have some people that are idle. Don't know why that they're idle. Harvest. Oh, so this worker post. Gotcha. Hey, we got farmers now. Okay. Um, set the amount of work in your farm to three. Assign plots to farm. Add. This is really cool. I am actually in love with this. Alright, I think that's good. Have at least one herbalist. Um, do I have a berry gatherer? I don't know if I put one down or not. I don't know. Are we done researching the kitchen? Let's research the horn blower. Let's see how our boy is doing. Just walking along. Don't know why you're walking, but you're walking. Uh, we're getting close to some nomads here. We might want to build some more housing. I kind of plotted them off, didn't I? Very interesting. We've got five idle. Um, so, I guess do general items, please. <laughs> You picked up a group of nomads who now joined your village. Hell yeah. Got all them villagers here with us. This is so soothing. Like this is incredibly soothing.
Definitely want to add some more plots. Take that as a resource. I feel bad for literally killing all these fucking trees. Is this almost done? Barely. <laughs> oh man, I feel bad for all of these trees. Am I going to be able to replant trees? Population level up. Your villagers have increased. Check them in the top bar. Uh, raw food, total food. Yeah, I've, wow, yeah, I have a lot more people now. This is awesome. Are we gonna pick up more villagers? What is this? Settlement, only one of a few remaining settlements that has yet to be swallowed by the poisonous plants. Some villagers might want to join us on Ombu, depending on their villagers' happiness. Build a scavenger hut to send expedition parties. Well, we don't have that. Did we... So we still have... They're still looking to complete it. I don't even know what I have here. Herbalist. Yeah, that's almost done. We seriously need to make sure everything is set tree-wise around here. Just feel bad for fucking destroying the forest on the Onbu's back. You know, I mean, we have we have a lot of space to work with, but it's also like we have a lot of space and we don't at the same time. Like it's actually a lot smaller if you think about it cuz you are living on an animal's back. Like if you think about it at the end of the day. <laughs> Got so many resources everywhere. What does this do? Makes berries, beets, and ombu blood into processed food. Gotcha. I think we need to finish. Um, What's it called? What we have here so we can have additional housing for my peeps. Like even, even here is almost done. One stone. Oh, it looks like we finished the herbalist. We need more water. <laughs> Definitely need more water. Do we have two plants? What? I don't know what that is, brother. Homeless. Bad food quality, bad food quality. So that's what it is. Well, we're building as many tents as we're able to right now. We need to build all these homes. Wow. Yeah, they do walk a lot faster. So if I build... Yes. There we go. Wow, wow, we wah. This is probably such a janky way to go about it, too, but... I mean, I'm just experiencing it for the first time. And I can always move things, but I have to deconstruct and then reconstruct them, which makes it... ...a little cumbersome. Uh, I'd like this to have it set as a high priority. Get the housings up there. Let's 
so let me see. This should be good. Choose your next research. Village doctor. All right, so we need to have a carpenter, stone cutter, and a kitchen, which I think... Uh, oh, yeah, I never put down a kitchen just yet. So a kitchen should probably be right here. Um... Carpenter. We'll put them right here. Horn blower. We'll put like right here. Uh, I don't know why. Use to issue commands to Onbu, which may or may not follow. Ask you to click on crossroads. Interesting. And then we'll put the stone cutter right here. Oh, actually. No. Uh, stone cutter. We'll go right here. And we need lots of more wood. This is so cool. Like, I really, really love this game. Um, we are gonna need... Harvest, or I mean, general, I think is fine if we keep it on general. I just feel bad for harvesting all of these trees on its back. Like, when are they going to come back? I have a system here for sure. So much shit happening here. So much. We just need all the wood. Give us all the wood. Wow. Can we mine for wood at Jason's sawmill? So, okay. So I would need to have a sawmill adjacent to these two areas here. Uh, now I can research. Oh, yeah, I'm researching the... Blood extractor. Sleep? No. Okay, so progress will be lost if I do that. Very interesting. Still haven't finished this mycologist. But everyone's working towards something right now. Everyone is working towards something. Let's see uh, where my boy is at. Uh-oh, we got a storm of brewing. Short cold snap, short temperature drop might affect the growth of plants. That's a big yike of Rooney's. Own boo hunger, 26%. So am I supposed to feed the onbu? I don't know if I'm supposed to feed the onbu or not. So my population's happy. That's good. Population is very happy. Oh, wow. I can fast. I can fast forward it. I don't have to go as slow as I was going. <laughs> Still, I don't think that was a bad. Oh, wait. I can go fast as fuck. 
I think two times speed is not bad. Um... Yeah, I don't think this is bad at all. Maybe even... We don't even have that resource, though. I think that's when we get it, when we get the carpenter. Oh yeah, we don't have a berry gatherer. I think a berry gatherer would be really good right here. Yeah. That is so fucking cute. And we passed by the storm. That was adorable. Choose your next research. Oh, yes. We definitely want that for sure. So we need lots of resources here. We need stones. We need wood. And that is probably like the biggest part of the research here that we have. I could play this game for hours. I could literally play this game for hours. Like, you guys have no idea. Because look, look how fucking just, like, sick it is. Like, not only is it beautiful, but it's simple and it's easy to follow. And there's a lot of cool stuff in here that just make it awesome. Yeah, you guys, this is a game, like, there is not much I have to complain about this game at all whatsoever. Like, at all. Wow, wow, we wah. Now we can actually build a horn blower? No, we can't. I want to see what they- I want them to finish building everything first. Oh yeah, did we not have- is this my kitchen? Yes. So we need wooden planks. I want to finish this stuff here first before moving forward. Like uh, the food refinement portion. Because the kitchen is almost... Damn. Yeah, we need stone slabs to make this kitchen. So we need a stone cutter. Yikes. So wood and stone. Oh, he's getting up! Oh no, he's still sleeping. Oh, sweepy, sweepy baby. Sweepy baby. Damn, we are We're doing it right now. We are really doing it. Definitely want to place the farming stuff a little bit better next time when I get the full game. But 
we got what we needed pretty much to start because we can't have this kitchen until we complete this. So we got all the wood, for, I mean, all the stones for that that we need. Got our berry gatherer here. That was in a good spot, too, to gather all the berries. Awesome. Yeah, I'm definitely going to save that. Uh, consider a wish list. I already have it on my wish list. Don't you worry. It's already there, but this is such a wonderful game. This is so soothing. This is something I literally could play for hours on end and not get bored. Like, I might get burned out because I will. I know I will put so much time into this game. But other than that, like, I'm so excited to get this game. And this is going to be really fun. Like, this will be a really fun, like, just chatting type thing or I could do it as like a video series for you guys I will wait and see what I want to do exactly with it but that is all the time I have for you guys today thank you guys so much for watching I highly appreciate your time as always but please do not forget to subscribe and or follow not only to my YouTube but to my Twitch you guys know where my YouTube is at you can find my Twitch at twitch.tv slash the game dame thanks guys and I'll see you in the next video bye bye